Charge your own pneumatic accumulator applications. It is vital that the gas pre-charge pressure, P0, is calculated and set correctly. But in order to calculate what this pre-charge pressure should be, we have to start with the end state in mind. Here we are demonstrating the calculations for a hydraulic energy storage application with a bladder type accumulator. The equation on the left tells us that the pre-charge pressure should be 90% or less than the minimum system pressure, P1. The equation on the right tells us that the maximum permitted pressure, P2, cannot be greater than four times the pre-charge pressure. This is also known as the pressure ratio. Here is an example of determining the correct pre-charge pressure for the accumulator and the system. With a minimum system pressure of 50 bar, we can use the 90% rule to determine that our pre-charge pressure should be 45 bar or less. And with a maximum system pressure of 160 bar, we can determine that the pre-charge pressure should be 40 bar or more. Therefore, a pre-charge pressure between 40 and 45 bar is acceptable. Using the same method, we can determine the pre-charge pressure using the minimum system pressure of 40 bar and a maximum system pressure of 200 bar. We can see that when calculated, the pre-charge pressure would need to be less than or equal to 36 bar, but at the same time, greater than or equal to 50 bar. Clearly, this isn't possible, and in this scenario, an adjustment to the minimum and maximum system pressures or a change in accumulator type may be required.